So I have this 150 watt heater and it's okay. Kept me to 52 degrees yesterday and I just wanted a little warmer. So I got this ceramic heater from Walmart. I paid $12.44 before tax for it. And um, this is 150 watts. This is 250 watts. And uh, this is what it looks like when you get from Walmart. It comes in a little plastic bag. And then there's the cautious statement and there's a, there's a manual. And it's about the why it shuts down and it'll shut down for overheating and it'll shut down for tipping. And since it's more wattage, this will run on 110. This is your tipping switch. And when it folds on the side, it goes up and shuts down the unit. Another major difference between this, this is a hundred, this is 12 volts. This little one is 12 volts, which is nice. I didn't have to run the inverter. This one is 110. I'll have to run the inverter. Now I use the Kodiak, did no, this is the Apex, there's the Kodiak. The Kodiak is getting solar energy now, recharging it. And there's the Apex, and it's 110. So I plug it 110, I'll turn it to 110. I'll turn on this heater. There it is. How to get the foot level and I ran I ran I ran this last night so the battery is at 27 and of course temporarily for now I'm going to charge the apex of the Kodiak and with 400 watts I don't have much trouble heating up both units and so it is taking 305 watts so it's a 250 watt heater hopefully when the voltage is up to 12.5 the, the watts will go down so when uh, the right now the voltage is, is uh, 1044 which it's saying it one bar and saying 26 percent i ran it last night like i said so uh, i'm gonna see if i should be warmer see that's that's the little switch the safety switch and if i run both of them together If I run both together, so there's the red light, there's the red light, and that means that heater is on. This is its heating coil, and this is its heating coil, a whole lot more heating coil. I'll put them right next to each other. See how tiny this hitting coil compared to that hitting coil? But together, together they sit at 370 watts. So uh, if I run them together, I'll have plenty of heat. If I run it independently, then I'll use the wattage for each individual one. And this, I did, I did color match it. They're both heating, so they're both red. This has a, 
a light on it that tells you it's on and this is its light to tell you that it's on so we uh, I'm going to disconnect everything charge up the apex of the Kodiak and the Kodiak is getting solar energy right now and I will definitely that's the Kodiak with the center button that's the apex with the switch button and uh, I definitely will have to run it off the apex and the Kodiak if I want to stay warm all night.